music knowledge as well if you want to give any history lesson. Okay. What's today? Oh, today's Van Morrison's birthday. Oh, it is? Yeah. Okay. I yeah. didn't see that on there. Do you know who Van Morrison is? I guess. Like he's in a band, we live? right? I think we're live. Hi. Good morning. Actually, actually, it's afternoon. I'm so sorry. Monday morning is flying by. <laughs> um, anyway, so welcome. We have Alyssa and Jenny today. Hello. I'm just going to make this a little bit different. So anyways, hope you guys are doing great. Um, hope you had a great weekend. Did you have a nice weekend? I did. It was nice. I moved. Moved. Worked. Yeah. That's right. Done. Moved. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So first of the month, end of the month, first of the month. Yeah. Awesome. Right. And then the bazaar was? The bazaar was good. Okay. We had a nice day on Saturday. Awesome. I was yeah. thinking of the bazaar when I wore this shirt today. Yeah. So I almost texted you. and was like, I'm wearing this. Do you want to match? Yeah. Today? Match, <laughs> match. I was like, we already did that. So anyways. All right. Well, mass so match. Oh, yeah. So thanks for tuning in. It's Music Monday. We have some great updates for you. Uh, we'll be breaking down Inspire, Collaborate, and Educate. We are planning an event, so we want to make sure that you guys have those details. Um, first off, we're getting some phone calls this morning through our phone, but I'm getting text messages and Facebook messages that our phone's not working. I'm not sure what's going on because I've tried it, Alyssa's tried it, and our phone is working. Like some people are calling, so I'm not sure what's happening. So I don't know if it's like a certain provider or um, what's going on. So I apologize, but feel free to message us, email us. We'll make sure that you guys are taken care of. I would like to give a huge shout out to the Greater um, Sarasota Chamber. They hosted their Small Business World Awards last Friday. And I want to say that they did an amazing job and they really set the bar high and the stage for, for uh, future virtual events. Um, I just thought they did a great job in their engagement. They literally had like 800 and something comments by the end of the event. Wow. 800 and yeah, something comments. It's ridiculous. So yeah. um, they did a lot of giveaways as well. Unfortunately, I didn't win anything, um, which makes me sad because I was literally commenting throughout mm. the whole thing. Right. I was probably like 700 of the comments. Um, so anyways, <laughs> I just wanted to give a huge shout out to the chamber and to all of the businesses that were nominated, that were finalists, and that were winners, along with those young professionals as well. So kudos to everybody. Uh, I also want to give thanks to SNN. Did you watch the, the feed? I did. It was okay. so great. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. SNN, um, Annette had featured Music Compound Saturday evening, and they featured our new program with Miss Julie War McHugh, musical theater and show choir programs that are going to be launching here at Music Compound this week. Uh, so if you are a fan of ours or if you watched it, definitely share it. Um, it always helps for us to tag when uh, our media partners showcase what we're doing. So we really want to give thanks that way as well. So thank you to SNN. We appreciate you. Um, okay, so Inspire. Uh, don't know if you guys watch any of our videos, but every Monday we drop a video of our students making music, making music together. And um, the, today we dropped uh, a band video as well. So Aaron, one of our instructors, took his band during COVID when they couldn't get here to rehearse and they created a music video and I think it's so super cool, especially this week since we'll be going through those audition videos to build the next band program. Yeah. Um, so anyway, so check that out. Once again, like, share. Um, you want to say anything about the it music was really, video? It was really good. It was um, a song called Feel Good. Yeah. Yeah. So it totally made me feel good this morning when I woke up and watched it. I yeah. loved it. So we'll be dropping some more of those as well. Um, so anyways, and if you're a member of ours and you want to, us to feature you, go ahead and send us a video, whether it's you performing solo with a family member. We really just want to make people feel good on Mondays and showcase yeah. what music we have going on. Um, so as far as collaborate, um, Rock Your Summer Reading is closing out today. Yeah. Um, we're really excited. We've actually had some people drop off some passports today and cash in on their prizes. Um, I don't know if many of you know how it kind of started, but when we were here sewing in March, right? Yeah. March, March and April. April. Um, I had wanted to do something last year, but just time didn't allow us to do that. So Alyssa, Kaylee, and I all built this Rock Your Summer Reading program and kind of outlined it. And then we went to local businesses and we asked them if they wanted to partner with us. We have a list of local businesses yeah. um, that partnered with us. So I do want to give them a huge shout out. So I'm going to go grab that sheet of paper because I don't remember everybody off the top of my head. Um, if you could tell them something about it too. Yeah, yeah. Well, I can name some of the businesses. We okay, had perfect. Fruitville Grove gave away uh, 
ice cream cones. The bazaar gave books to our readers. Um, we've had we collaborated with Capo Kids. You can take a half hour Capoeira class. Um, let's not let's create a, uh, a change of art or a change of heart. Yeah. Art. Um, paint pouring kits. Chick fil A, PDQ, um, I mean, so many. Oh, Evie's. Nothing Bundt Cake, which was a finalist at one of the Chamber Awards. Evie's on the range. They can go golfing as well. Um, first watch. Did you say first watch? I didn't say first watch. First, first watch. watch. $20 gift card, so, which is absolutely amazing. Music Compound donated. Janet Combs Photography and Big Cat Habitat. So thank you to all of our partners and for everybody that partnered with us for uh, the Rock Your Summer Reading Program. Yeah. We will be picking a winner of the grand prize on Friday. Woo! And that grand prize is going to consist of a party here at Music Compound whenever you feel safe for up to 25 people. Kona Ice has donated a gift certificate. Shout out to our friends at Kona Ice. Um, Let's Jump donated a bounce house for us oh, as nice. well. And then we have a pizza sponsor um, or music compound we're paying for it if we don't get that sponsor teed up by then. Um, but anyway, so it's a great time for everybody to come together and have fun. The party's valued at over $600. So um, anybody that turns in their passport today will be entered in to win. And if it's tomorrow, we understand today is the first day of school and everyone's kind of going crazy. Yeah. Um, so once again, tune in to our Rock Your Summer Reading Program. Facebook group, which if you have been reading books and you are part of that, definitely upload some pictures and let us know. Uh, we would love to feature your photo or something on our website because we do plan to do this every single year. So hopefully a lot of our business partners will come on board. Or if you want to be a business partner and you missed out this week or this year, you can um, contact us and we'll happily accept your donations for next year. It was um, a lot of fun. The kids really enjoyed it. Yeah. Everyone that came in here, they were so well, excited for something fun to do. Over right. the summer, you know. Well, and one of the young ladies that picked up her or dropped off her passport today said they took a road trip. So she wrote, read 15 books on the road trip. And some of these parents have to beg their children to read. And they didn't have to do that this year. So kudos to everybody that participated in that program and to our partners. We really appreciate it. Uh, so we're going to move on to educate. And then we have um, our event about to save the date. So um, as far as our groups, we have lots of things available, right? We have lots of groups, yeah. So do you remember any up. time frames for the Kids Rock that we could mention? Um, we have availability? They're getting pretty full. We do have availability in the afternoon classes during our enrichment program. Okay. Um, I believe that's 1 p.m. on Tuesdays, Tuesdays and, and Wednesdays. Tuesdays and Wednesdays, yes. Yeah. Tuesdays and Wednesdays. Um, there's still space available in our Friday downtown Kids Rock class at One 4 p.m. Just one spot, yeah. yeah. Um, we have lots of space available in our Rising Stars Junior Rockers program. Mm -hmm. um, that's for ages 8 to 11, 11. A little bit more advanced, wanting to pick an individual instrument and not rotate, rotate them yeah. all. So, so. The, the main difference between the two programs is one is ages 4 to 7, and within that program they play guitar, piano, and drums within that same weekly 50-minute class. Um, Rising Stars is a band program for 8 to 11 year olds. They select the instrument that they're going to play in that band program. And it's a great introduction to our youth band program, which is our middle school and high school band program. So if you have someone that's looking to engage with others, wants to play music with others, um, wants to be in a band type of setting and atmosphere, give us a call back. We do have those classes and they're, they're later. They're like 5.30 or 6.30 Wednesday or Thursday. Miss Alicia does run all of those programs. Alyssa is one of our instructors, and we do have an assistant for classes of five or six students per class. Um, and then we have lots of availability in our show choir, which is with Miss Julie on Tuesdays from 5 to 7. So if you're a middle school or a high schooler, which you're probably in school right now, but if your parent is tuning in, um, that is singing, it's dancing, it's lines. It is going to be a fabulous program, 5 to 7 on Tuesdays. We have a lot of availability in there. We actually are going to push the start date to next week to get a couple more students into that class. But all the other classes start this week, so we look forward to welcoming everybody back into the studio. We're really, really excited. Um, we have welcome gifts for everybody that comes in for their lessons. Um, so anyways, we're just excited. We want to say thank you for trusting us and being part of our, our journey, and we're happy to be part of your music journey as well. So let us know. We have a variety of different things. Just call us. We cater to all ages. We have tons of stuff. <laughs> 
people. Yeah. <laughs> Acting classes, art oh, classes. Yeah. yeah. So during the day, as Alyssa's mentioning, we have programs from one to four. So if you are taking on the homeschooling and you're looking for enrichment classes, we have a variety of stuff. Uh, Monday is drama and art. Tuesday is music and something else. And Wednesday is dance and music. And then Thursday is um, show choir as well, our musical theater and band. So we have a lot of things available during that one to four time frame. So if you are looking to get your kids out of the house, get them engaged, socializing with like-minded individuals, and you just want some quiet time to take care of your other things that you're doing, right. send them to us. And you can pick one day or you can pick all four days, whatever works best for you. So um, anyway, so save the date, September 26th. We are going to host an event. It is National Family Day. So we wanted to bring all of our families back together and host an event. It's going to be at the Bazaar at Apricot and Lime, which is our downtown studio. They have a fabulous court, uh, courtyard outside. There's a food truck there. We're going to have live music. Our enrichment partners will be there with tables, passing out some information about their programs. If you have a child-based business or something that's family-oriented and you want to be part of the event, just reach out to us. We'll, we'll happily discuss the options. Um, if we have the room, we would like to welcome you here. We're committed to helping everybody rebuild um, as we kind of reopen a lot of different things and just make sure people know that we're here. Um, so if you're interested. And yes, yeah, so that's um, September 26th. I think it's 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. I can't remember the hours that we outlined for it. I don't think it's 10. I think it's 11. But anyways, all of our student bands will be performing there. So and if you're um, one of our students that's not a part of the band, you want to perform, just reach out. And anyways, I'm talking way too much, way too fast. <laughs> It'll be a lot of fun. Food truck there. Yeah. yeah. All Shopping kinds inside of fun. the bazaar. And now, what is this resort thing that they have with a pool? Oh, we just put a, we put a little kiddie pool out there and okay. an umbrella and some lawn beach chairs and just kind of made a little splash pad. Do humans get in the, the, the pool or is yeah. it just for puppies? Yeah. No, no, no. It's <laughs> Actually, I didn't see any puppies in the pool. Oh. Um, I did see little Theo, though. He's one of our regulars that comes in all the time. Oh, okay. He was splashing around and really enjoying it. That's and awesome. He's young. He's two. And I think his mom enjoyed it as well because it kind of kept him in mm -hmm. one spot for a little right. while. <laughs> I love it. The only reason I said puppies because I had a dog. And so I bought her one of those plastic pools yeah. because it's so hot out. And I was right. just like, she was driving me crazy inside. It was just like, go outside. Right. You can't really do that with kids. You yeah. can't really do that with animals. Well, maybe we have to Why get another I don't have pool children. Um, <laughs> anyway, so, all right. So we really appreciate it. Kaylee will be back next week um, with us as well. So um, as far as in the studio this week, Alyssa and I are taking care of all of our members, our teachers, and any of your music needs, reach out to us. We're here to serve. Um, and if you have any questions... Anything else you can think of? No. Nope. All right. That's well, it. we wish you guys a beautiful week. If you're doing anything music related, tag Music Compound, send us a video. We want to be part of it. And if you're doing virtual concerts as well, put those on our virtual concert uh, group page. And oh, everyone loves you, Alyssa. Uh. <laughs> All right, friends. We'll talk to you soon. We hope you have a great day. Bye. Bye. Who is that?